Hey, hey, what's up, YouTube? Been a long time. Um, just been busy. Wife's had uh, had her second child the other day, so I'm excited. We had a girl, so I have a son that's two and a half and a daughter that's three days old. So super, super stoked. Anyways, you guys may have tell there's been a lot of changes to the tank. Um, just ma ma mainly plants. Scape, obviously, is still the same. I did cut down the branch. If you look at my previous videos, this piece of driftwood had a branch that came up like this. That was really, really nice. Only problem is, uh, it just got in the way. I liked the way it looked when it was outside the tank. When it was in the tank, I think it was just too big. So, I think it looks a lot better now. Back here in the back, I got, uh, I wanna say that's water wisteria. You see the leaves on the tops. They used to look like that on the bottom, a little roundish, and then then it turned into a, you know, this branchy-ish looking leaf. So I think this is water wisteria. Um, obviously, the people at the store don't know what they're doing because they sold that to me as bacopa. Um, but it's fine. I, I like the way this is turning out. I never seen water wisteria until I, until this. Um, so that's coming out pretty good. Uh, the sword, it's got new sprouts on it. Every, at least every other day there's a new sprout coming out on it. You can see the damage that's been taken. I did change my light. I put my, my T5 HOs on it. Um, it doesn't look this dark in, in person. It's actually a lot lower light than what's coming out on the, uh, the video. But, uh, my last light... My plants took a crazy, crazy hit with algae just because it was a, a 10,000K. Obviously, it was too much. So, I got my 6,500K bulbs in there. I got one blue bulb, one red bulb, and two 6,500K bulbs. Blue bulb was just to make the fish pop. They don't really do anything for plants. I know that. I don't care, though. Um, the sag over here, still not sure whether it's dwarf sag or not. But there was one little runner I saw this morning pop up right there. So, so stoked, pretty stoked on that. Um, these three um, Crip Wendetis that I got are doing good a lot better since I've changed the light over and started dosing too. I'll tell you that about that here in a second. Um, back here in the back, I got these stem plants and I can't remember the name of them. Sorry guys, but basically they look like an Amazon sword on stems. That's a cool plant. Really like that plant. You can see the new growth right there. Um, there's a couple other new growths back there and there. So that, this is going to be like all Amazonish area back here, which can be pretty good. Uh, I got some Christmas moss down in here. Also got some extra Christmas moss in there. Basically these I'm just going to use just for growing out. And then I'm going to tie a bunch of moss all over this uh, piece of driftwood. Uh, back here, the Crips, as you guys can tell from the 10,000 K bulbs, uh, LED light, these Crips took a beating, you know, that's my fault. Um, haven't done plants in a while, so, and you can see down here all the beating that these plants took with algae. You see all these leaves right here with algae all over them? All of them used to look like that until I got rid of the 10,000 K bulb. Started using my T5s and uh, started dosing again. Dosing and these things have just gone crazy with dosing. Um, I also got myself still in the pot. Just letting it acclimate, do its thing instead of the pot. I'm not sure where I'm going to put it yet. I was thinking about putting... This is um, Compact Hygro. Um, and I was thinking about putting that here. Here. Sorry about my son. He's taking a shower. He's not happy. Here here and here just fill that in all compacted all nice keep it short a little bit taller than it is now but not too much taller we're just keep it nice and short and thick anubius not doing good only because of the 10,000 K so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do with that but as you can tell with the new light and the dosing I got a new little sprout back there that's looking good so we'll see what happens with that other than that um, that's the tank guys 
it's doing good it's a uh, it's got probably about oops sorry guys it's probably got about 10 zebra danios in it i got one uh was that chinese algae eater I forgot the name of that guy um he did good because i started getting some black hair algae and he just gobbled that all up and then i got my fighting fish i love fighting fish i don't care what anybody says they're the coolest fish in the world um i also got a good deal when i bought my plants because it came with good good snails as you can see look at that big fatty right back there there's a couple little more there's one right there there's one right there and i see eggs every now and then on the plants but those are not trumpet snails those are the good snails the the cleaning snails all they do is just absolutely clean 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 all day long so those are just kind of good little freebie I got from there. Haven't seen any trumpet snails, so I'm excited about that. Don't want to get any trumpet snails. Can't stand those little guys. Um, these snails, whatever these snails are, they don't re reproduce as much or as quickly. Um, and they clean. They're all over the plants, eating the algae off the plants. They're all over the wood, eating the algae off the wood, etc. So... Um, but that's pretty much about it guys uh tanks tanks doing good i'm stoked on it uh i can't wait till these uh the water wisteria grows in to where it's just all bushy because i've seen it on youtube and it gets real bushy so i'm super stoked about that uh also because i would just really want a jungle theme on this uh this tank just let it go don't care about trimming it don't care about mainly or not really not maintaining it but maintaining it let the plants do its thing let it grow let it go just fucking jungle it up sorry about my language anyways guys let me know what you guys think um let me know i'm trying to get back into the youtube and do videos so hard with my son and my daughter my wife summertime you guys know how it goes but uh let me know what you guys think all right later